what is going on guys this is pbz fab master and today we are playing the disco knot imp deck now infinity is my 10x hero and i felt the need to craft some of these fabulous disco knots right here just to make this deck now this deck is what we call an aggro deck which is pvz or card game jargon for aggressive now normally uh in plants vs zombies heroes aggro decks are not that good at performing because there's a block meter in this game but here's where this card comes in all cards with two attack or less have bullseye which means it doesn't uh charge your opponent's block meter and as you can see there is a ton of cards in this deck that uh have two attack or less uh all these imps right here this is a very great one two three combo uh imposter uh toxic waste imp then imp commander this is a very good card to combo with the, the, the Disco Knot because the overshoot damage that hurts the uh, plant hero. That is all bullseye, which means that wouldn't charge the block meter if uh, this got this girl right here is on the board. Uh, we're running some Fire Roosters. They're a really good card with that. Three, dam three bullseye damage. Uh, excellent stuff right there. It's also really good with Infinity's Deadly Superpower. It's pretty dope. Uh, two Quasars, just because I have them, then they're fun. Pogo mixed up Grave Digger for the win, and uh, we're running two of these environments, the Moon Base Z, just for more overshoot bullseye damage, hopefully, with this thing. And we're running these as graveyards just for a little, these graveyards just for environments and a little bit of damage boost. So, it's an aggressive deck, uh, doesn't normally work in Plants vs. Zombies, works pretty well with this deck, uh, not great. I think it'll go 2-1 and one today, we'll see though, maybe it's gonna go 3-0. Maybe I'll play more or less than three games, depending on how things happen to go. But here we go. Oh, wow. Fast matchmaking much. Okay. So we got a rank 35 green shadow. Ultimate league player, probably running click peas. I'm still looking after those. I'm still hunting for click peas. I didn't get them early access or anything. I'm just, that's why I, ha I have infinity as the 10x hero. We're just still hunting. So get rid of this. Get rid of this. Oh, come on. We're looking for early game here. That's how this deck works. You just rush them down early. You don't want mixed up grave diggers in your starting hand, so that really sucks. We're gonna put this here. You don't want your mix. You don't want like you don't even want pogos in your starting hand. You just want those are like finishers in this deck. Uh, it's good that he didn't have anything to take that out. We got the aggressiveness going early. You don't really want any pogos or mixed up grave diggers in your starting hand, even though they're great cards. Obviously, you want to just rush them down here. And we'll play Toxic Waste Imp. He's playing his Banana Peel, huh? Okay. He's playing a Banana Peel. I see what you're... I actually don't see what you're doing, but okay then. Maybe he's playing some sort of Green Shadow Conjure deck or something. I don't freaking know. I don't even know anymore. I'm playing an aggro deck in Plants vs. Zombies Heroes, which normally doesn't work. And hey, here's the bullseye value right here. Here it is, folks. There is the bullseye value. Alright, alright, using the superpower. And freezing the rooster. Not bad, not bad, not bad moves at all, but we're gonna do five damage to him with. Yep, that's five. It'll be down to eight health. And it's just turn four is incoming, and he's already down to eight health. That's how fast this deck works. That is how fast it is. And we're just gonna play Imp Commander here. We could have lethal rush. <laughs> Rest in peace, my friend. Rest in peace. Oh my goodness gracious. I don't know if I'm going to actually be playing four games today or something. If this deck just does really well today. There's the 150 tickets. There's my third click piece. I mean, I've been playing a lot of PvZ this week. I haven't been too busy with my life. Like I said, like I say, sometimes I have no life, but I actually do sort of have a life. This is sort of what I do in my spare time, though. I play this game because it's fun. Anyway. <laughs> enough ranting about myself. Time to get into another game. Here we go. Is that the same dude? I don't think it is. I think we were playing a rank 35 green shadow. Now we're against the rank 34 green shadow. Is that the same guy, though? Is it? I'm not sure. Alright, we got ourselves a disco knot. That's great. Got that. That's also good. Uh, get rid of Pogo. Like I said, early stuff. There we go. Early early game is where it's at in this uh, deck. We're just going to play this again. We want the Disco Knot in lane 4. I mean, we sort of want to combo something with that on like turn 3 or maybe, maybe turn 2 if we get another 1 drop. That's sort of how that works. 
you don't want to just play the disco knot on turn one because it could get taken out easily. And he's passing again. This is all right. I don't know if this is the same guy. I'll definitely have to look back at the footage of this and see if this is the same green, sh the same green shadow we're just abusing with this deck. And uh, give me something good, Quasar. Give me something good, buddy. Rust bolt. Ah, we're gonna be rust bolt, huh? We gonna be rust bolt. Alrighty then. If this is the same guy. I wonder if he'll just concede again. Oh. Don't have snow. Ah, yeah. Oh boy. It's freeze versus aggro. This is not looking good. We'll see if we can out uh, aggro him, I guess. I don't know. We'll see if we uh, the snowdrops beat us, though. Because the snowdrops, they can beat us if he's got enough freezy cards in his hand. If he's got enough frosty stuff, we ain't got a prayer. That's unfortunately how this works. What do you have there, Green Shadow? Ah, oh, she's keeping it, huh? Maybe it's maybe she got her free superpower. That would suck. Um, we're gonna do it like this. Here and here. We're about that life right now. It's like bring it on. If you got anything you need to freeze with, I mean, what are you gonna have? Like one freeze target at most. If you're gonna have two freezes right now, that's just proof that you're just all lucky. And freeze. Freeze or not? Nah? Alright, no freeze. That's good. So here's three more bullseye damage courtesy of, uh, what's his name? Loose Cannon. Unfortunately, our Disco Knot dies, but once again, our opponent's already down to 10 health, so that ain't bad. And here, do we? I think Imp Commander and Rust Bolt Super is actually a little better than Pogo here. We'll play Pogo mixed up Grave Digger a little off curve. I think that's how that's gonna... That's how that's going to go down. Oh boy, here comes the freezing. Here comes the freezing. See, here's why we have this. Although that's going to buff Black Eyed P, which sort of sucks. That sort of sucks. But we got to nerf this snowdrop right here. And get nerfed. We don't want, we don't want to be taking any damage here. And that draws us a card, too. Thanks, Rust Bolt. Thanks for letting us be you, I guess. And we're still doing damage to him, and M Commander's still getting us some card draw value. We got plenty of cards in our hand. It's all good, man. M Commander's still alive, too. Four health is... Pretty good. Pretty good, if I do say so myself. Uh, we're gonna play Pogo. See what needs to be Pogo'd. And we will pogo it. Oh, that needs to be pogoed right now. Uh, go away, Snapdragon. We don't want you here, buddy. Oh. He's buffing our, our his little uh, snowdrop up again. Well, this needs to be bounced. We don't want that doing any big damage, so that's, that's why. Uh, should we play this? Well, why would we, though? Why would we want to play that? I don't know. I'm not going to play it. I'm not going to play any tricky, tricky stuff. Alright, she blocked. What you going to get? Okay, she's holding on to whatever she got. Which makes me a little bit suspicious. But... Here comes the mixed up grave diggers, so... Concede? Maybe? We'll see. There's Pogo... There's Mixed Up Grave... Oh, no, there's Toxic Waste Imp. There's Mixed Up Grave Digger. Okay, I think we won here. I think what happens is we just won. There's Pogo. There's Mixed Up Grave Digger. I think we got it right here. This is guaranteed lethal, so... BM value. And we won. Bad manners for the win. And who cares that we didn't block, because... Ba-boom! Mixed up Grave Digger. Rest in peace. Green Shadow. This deck is 2-0 right now. I'd say it's doing pretty good. I'd say it's doing pretty freaking good. If I do say so myself. Rank 38. Give me them gems. Give me them gems. Thank you. 
Alrighty then. Maybe we'll do two more games just because of that one guy conceding. And people do concede with this deck. Just they're just like they just see the pogo mixed up grave digger and they're like, ah, I have no shot of winning this game. We're playing some relatively high ranked players here too. We got Green Shadows, Grass Knuckles. That he ain't no clown too. He's freaking good. So we'll see if we can compete with him. So get rid of the mixed up grave digger. Like I say, not how you play this deck. Moonbase Z, is it good here? We already have that as an environment, so we'll get rid of it right there. Ooh, got the clones in the house. Imposter, you're a great turn one play, but this is a little bit better. It's a little bit better. And there we go. Clones are in the house. And I'm actually kind of happy that that traded with that, because we don't want them wearing us down with the bullseye damage. We don't want him wearing us down. And uh, should we play Quasard for fun? Of course we should. Give me that superpower, Quasard. What we got? Ah, we're brain freeze, huh? Were we just brain freeze earlier? I think we were. Or maybe I was just playing off camera, but whatever. Whatever. And he's going with his superpower. Okay. So it's four damage to face and rest in peace, Quasard. It's not the best grass knuckles super thing ever. It's all right, though. Okay. What do we do here? We'll do this. We'll do that. And maybe we'll either play that or that. We'll see. We shall see. The point is, we're being very, very aggressive. And I don't know what sort of deck this is, but it's a very weird one to say the least. We'll just play our graveyard and we'll chill for now. I don't know if this guy's deck is essentially the best when he's playing like cactuses and freaking uh, what's the dude's name? Uh, the sting bean. Those aren't easy. Those aren't essentially. Those aren't really the best cards, I guess. Those aren't really the best cards, is what I'm trying to say. So, anyway. And these imps right here, they're pretty good. They are pretty good. And you, you got the freaking flower thing. Okay, cool. Well, guess what? Fire Rooster is going to kill that. He doesn't know that. Nah, I don't know it. But rest in peace to your flower, my friend. Rest in peace. And our rooster is now a 4 1 too. So, hopefully, he doesn't block that 4 1. But he might. Yeah, at least it's looking like he will. Oh, wow, he rolled double ones. He, <laughs> he didn't block the four damage. He didn't block it. We will, we will block you. Nah, he didn't block it, though. That's the thing. And that freaking Morning Glory is doing some heat. Uh, definitely here with the Fire Rooster. It's really good. That is good stuff right there. And Disco Knot for the win, maybe? We're gonna do this. Oh wait, mixed up grave diggers in the house. Ah, we're not doing mixed up grave digger. We're doing this, and we're doing this, and we're gonna freeze, hopefully for the win. We're gonna maybe for BM value is what this freeze is for. But I think it's actually maybe we will maybe we don't even win this turn out. Actually, we don't even win. But this freeze is still really good value. And freeze value. There we go. Got that bullseye damage in. He's down to one. <laughs> There's the concede. There it is. Are we still recording here? Yep, we got. We're recording, all right. And we're doing just fine. Three and oh. There is the concede. Bringing in my special, my special friend, the uh, thing we conjured from. Uh, what's it called? Uh, uh, Quasar Wizard. I, I don't know why I forget all the cards' names like when I'm playing the game, but I'm not a scrub. You can see I'm three and zero today, but I ain't a scrub or anything. But and to finish it off, we're playing the rank ten. Watch me like lose to the rank ten. Like I beat all the people and around my rank, but like I just l lose to lowlier level players. Watch that just happen. All right, here we go. 
we're going to get rid of this. We want that in case he's got some sort of fly trap combo. I know he's only a rank 10, but you don't really need to uh you don't really need to pay up that much money to have a good heal deck. You don't really need to pony up to pop cap that much. That's why they're trying to nerf heal decks just so you just have pay to win things. That's why those they got those freaking cards upcoming that they're just going to nerf the frick out of uh the uh, heal decks, and we're just gonna go disco, not disco, not deadly next turn, just because that's what we feel like doing. And he's got that rolling with. Okay then. All right. You go and you go ahead and make those inefficient trades, buddy. You go ahead and you do you. You do you. All right. Do we actually still deadly here, or do we go with imposter? Now nah, let's just rush the board. Let's go with imposter. Here we go, and there we go. Oh, this deck is working beautifully today. It is working beautifully. I've actually had lots of, like, harsh losses with this deck, where I have I ended up, like, getting none of my, like, early game in the starting hand. Like I said a million times already, you want to rush your opponent down with your ones and two drops. Your imp commanders and pogos and mixed-up grave diggers, those are for, like, the late finish, where you just... In case, those are just sort of just-in-case cards. And we're gonna pogo here, but... Those aren't, like, the necessariest cards to this deck. But the ones and two drops, that's where it's at. That is legit where it's at. And he's just playing his little chili pepper. Too slow. Too slow. And get bounced. More bullseye value. We are running a little low on cards. Maybe we should have deadlied a while ago, but... We're gonna get a th yeah, we got our little uh, infinity clone buddy. That's pretty good. We are infinity, so it's very fitting. Do we just mixed up grave digger here? I feel like that's the best way because then that's how we'll probably get a concede. You know? Do we do that play or do we just? I think we're actually gonna rush the board here. Everything has bullseye. What you got? <laughs> here we go. Got. Three concedes, four games, four wins. I'm I'm a happy dude today. This is PBZ Fabmaster. We got we got four and oh. Uh like this video if you like to see uh an awesome deck like this, cause it's pretty awesome. It's actually performed badly before, but today it's good. Bye bye.